Hi guys, Technic Time in here. Welcome back to another video. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make uh, one of these tracks. Um, this track is this track is kind of special because it has suspension. Um, so I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let's just get right into the tutorial. Okay, so I'm gonna, going to be showing you how to make the other side. This I believe would be the left side of um, the vehicle, but it doesn't really matter which way you put it. But that would be uh, most likely the left side of the vehicle. I'm just gonna put that aside. Um, okay, so we're just gonna start off with, first time I'll show you the pieces. These are the pieces that you are going to need. Um, you're going to need 29 of those black pins and 53 tracks. And then I've already made one of these little things um, but you can just kind of see those pieces that I've used. Um, so yeah, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video once again. Um, and now let's get into the tutorial part. Okay, so first off, um, you want to grab these two connector, um, pieces. And then you want to grab these two blue pins. And you're just gonna put them on one side of both of these, like this. Then you're gonna grab one of these three long stud axles and you're gonna basically put that in between here. Okay. Once you've done that, you wanna grab one of these 15 long beams. You're gonna need six of these. You're just gonna find the middle and you're gonna put it in the middle. It's not that hard. Once you put that in the middle, um, you're gonna grab, um, you're gonna grab six of these black pins um, and you're just gonna place them on here like this and then you want to do the um, same thing on the other side of course I've tried to make um, so like this I've tried to make these tracks as symmetrical as possible um, so yeah now you're gonna grab another one of two actually two more these 50 long beams and you're just gonna put them on there like this Okay, once you've done this, um, we're gonna grab two of these black pins. We're gonna put them in there like that. And two more, and you probably already know you're gonna do the exact same thing on the other side. Next, what you wanna do is grab two of these, and then one of these is gonna go like this, and the other one is gonna go like this. Oh, shoot, dropped it is going to go like this. So that's how it will look. Next, uh, we're going to be making this one. I've already made one, um, but I actually am going to show you guys how to make it. But first, let me just put this one on here. So you're going to put one in there and, and one in there. This is how it's going to look. Okay, so now we're going to put this aside and we'll show you how to make one. So if you want to make one of these, you're just going to grab two of these nine long beams. You're going to need two of these black pins, two of these three long blue pins. You're going to need one of these. You're going to need a spring, of course. You're going to need one three stud long axle and one of these little like gear wheels. Um, and you are also going to need five stud long axle plus two of these little pieces okay so first what we're going to do is you're just going to grab this nine long beam put one um, of these three long on there and one on there next you want to put this in there the, and then just put this weird gear thing on there uh, you want to put the spring on this lowest one and then this uh, little can, this little piece that you fit around it on the first one um, then you just want to click the second piece on um, what you want to do next is you're going to grab your two black pins and put them oops dropped it put them on these sides like that then for the finish you're just going to put this uh, five stud long axle through here and put these two stoppers on it so um, it can't really slide out and then you're just gonna grab your build and you're gonna put one in here and then one in. Actually, no, you wanna put it this way around. 
Sorry. Okay. Put one in there and one in there. Okay. So, yeah. I'm just going to make another one. Let's see. Just, just grabbing the exact same pieces again. I'll show you how to make it again. I'm not really going to explain it this time. But I'm just going to show you still. gonna skip one space go like that and then skip one space on the other side and you'll have this okay guys now that we have this um we're we can actually um make the other side so we want to actually grab these two beams and these big ones so um um uh, actually so you're gonna grab this um and you're just gonna basically um, put it through here. Then leave one space left over there. Then what you wanna do is put one of these on. Make sure there's one space right there. Then you are going to put the um, weird gear thing on there. Like that. Then you're going to put another one of these on. Um, and then you are done for that part. I'm gonna do the exact same thing with this one. We're just gonna um, we're just gonna grab these two pieces, and then we're just going to um, grab this one. This one's five long instead of the other one. The other one's seven long. This one's five long because this one. Um, when you put it on there, you're gonna put it on there like that. So there is nothing sticking out on the other side. Just push that one on there. Then put the big gear on. Put another one of these things. And you're good. Okay. Oh, shoot, it pops off. Okay, now we're gonna we're gonna put this aside. You're now going to make um the other side, like you see on there. Um, so what we're going to do for that is um, you're just going to grab one of these. We're gonna, kind of going to do the same thing um, as we did before. We're going to grab that, put two on there, grab two more, and then you're going to find the middle. Go one to the side, go one to the side. Okay, then you're just going to put these two on here. Blah, blah, blah. It's not that hard. Then what you want to do is Put two black pins in here. And like that. You're going to grab these two remaining parts. You're going to put them on. You're going to just click them on there like that. Okay, once you've done that, you're going to grab these two three long axles. And actually, we'll do that later. Because it's a little easier. Let me do it later. Grab this part that we just made, and just gonna slide it on, and just make sure it clicks on everywhere. Oops, that fell off. Just make sure it just clicks on everywhere. Um, let's see, it's kind of hard. Gosh, it's kind of hard to do this on camera. It's kind of hard to do this in the air. There we go. Okay, perfect. So um, this is what um, your track will look like. Uh, then what you want to do is just go to this side. Depending on what side of the track you're making. I'm making the right side of the track in my case. I'm going to put this on the right track. So then the motor could be attached to there. Okay, um, that's all good. Then you're going to go to the top on here. That's why these little things are here. You're going to put one of these gears. You're going to get a three stud long axle. And push it just push it through like this nice and easy boom you're done do the same thing on the other side like 
this. Okay. Perfect. Now, um, we do have these three extra remaining um, pins. Um, you could use these for multiple things. Um, one thing I would use it for is just put one here so you could touch the motor. Um, and then you would you could probably put these pins um, probably in here somewhere to connect it to the chassis. Now, I'm not telling you guys to do it this way, but that's how I would do it. And then for the last part, of course, the track. So I'm just gonna track, pull this around, pull this one around, make sure it goes around the track correctly, and then just click this into place, and then just kind of drive it, and boom, there you have it on the other side of the track. And these are the two tracks. Um, so yeah, guys. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video. Make sure to like and subscribe for more. Um, see you in the next video. Bye, guys.